No, I'm not switching away from Final Cut Pro. But just because I choose to edit in Final Cut Pro doesn't mean I can't or shouldn't use other software, especially if it makes my life easier. Take add-in captions, for example. There's really no easy way to auto-generate captions in Final Cut Pro, but in CapCut, you can auto-generate and add animated captions in just a few clicks. So when I need captions for my videos, I use CapCut. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to auto-generate animated captions in CapCut and use them in Final Cut Pro. And to give full credit where credit is due, this video was largely inspired by Emily from Eleven Editing. I'll link her channel down below. First thing we need to do is export our project from Final Cut Pro. You can do your entire project, or if you just need captions for a specific part, like the intro or outro of your video, you can export just that part of your timeline. Press R on your keyboard to switch to the Range tool, and click and drag out a range in your timeline you want to caption. If you're exporting just a specific part of your timeline, I find it helpful to add a marker right at the start. This will help with lining up our captions. Also, if you have background music, sound effects, or any other audio, you'll get the best results if you mute it. Go to your timeline index, select the roles tab, and uncheck every audio roll except for dialogue. Hit the share button and select export file. We only need to export the audio from our project, so click the settings tab and select audio only. Click next, give it a name, and save this file in your preferred save destination. Next, open up CapCut and make a new project. Click the import button, grab your Final Cut Pro export and import it into CapCut. Add this file to your timeline. In the top right corner, click on text and select auto captions. Choose your language and click the generate button to automatically generate captions for your clip. Go up to the inspector window, select the captions tab, skim through your captions, and if necessary, correct any mistakes. I find CapCut to be very accurate, and most of the time, the auto-generated captions are bang on. Even with a free version of CapCut, which is what I have, you get a ton of options to animate and customize your captions. Take a little bit of time here and play around to make these look exactly the way you want. There's a ton of cool animated templates. Once you have your captions looking the way you want, to make them easier to isolate in Final Cut Pro, let's add a green background. Go back to the media browser, click on library, and search for a green background. Add it to your timeline between your audio and your captions. Ripple trim this out to match the length of your clips. Hit the export button, make sure your project resolution and frame rate match your Final Cut Pro project, and export your clip. Import this clip into Final Cut Pro, Add it to your timeline and line up the start of this clip with your marker. Make sure the waveforms line up and turn the volume all the way down. To remove the green background, go to the effects browser and from the mask and keying category, add the green screen keyer to your top clip. In just a few simple steps, we have these cool animated captions in our project. I do wish you could do this natively in Final Cut Pro, but as of right now, you can't. You don't have to completely abandon the software of your choice just because it's missing a feature or two, but don't be scared to try something else that can make your life easier. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.